she became increasingly interested in politics. And with John Macy, this was her entry into that world. She wanted to know why some people were poor and some people were not. She thought that was incredibly unjust. And she began to look at why that was the case. From out of the dark. How did I become a socialist? By reading. It's no easy thing to absorb through one's fingers a book of 50,000 words on economics, but it is a pleasure I shall enjoy repeatedly until I have made myself familiar with all the classic socialist authors. Socialism was an enormously appealing uh, movement in the early decades of the 20th century. Peter Hall, historian. It flourished in circles of educated people, especially educated young people. A photo of women sitting in a circle on a grassy lawn. It can't be unreasonable to ask of a society a fair chance for all. It can't be unreasonable to demand the protection of women and children and an honest wage for all. When shall we learn that we are all related one to the other, that we are all members of one body. A photo of Helen touching a leafy fern. Helen would go on to write articles for The Call, a New York City socialist newspaper. A collage of article headlines. Its women's pages regularly discussed birth control, wages for women workers, and childcare. Closing title, Becoming Helen Keller. Text, premieres Tuesday, October 19th, 9 o'clock, 8 central time. Logo, PBS. Watch on the PBS video app.